This is comer to eat preterite sentences. Now, comer is a regular preterite ER verb. So you chop off the ER and you add I, I-S-T-E, I-O, I-M-O-S, I-E-R-O-N, and there's an accent in the yo form and the he form. If you're not familiar with those forms, comer, preterite, check out my clip labeled comer, preterite forms before you try this clip, okay? I'm going to read each of these sentences in English, then Spanish, and then clap. And after I clap, I'd like you guys to repeat just the Spanish with me, okay? Number one, I ate the tacos. Yo comí los tacos. Yo comí los tacos. Number two, Angela and Jesús ate my burrito. Angela y Jesús comieron mi burrito. Angela y Jesús comieron mi burrito. Number three, Carlos and I ate the apples. Carlos y yo comimos las manzanas. Carlos y yo comimos las manzanas. And finally, number four, the tall girl ate the cheese. La chica alta comió el queso. La chica alta comió el queso. Now, I ate the tacos. Again, it has an accent because for all regular AR, ER, and IR predator verbs, the yo form and the he form have an accent. Okay? So pretty straightforward, I ate the tacos. Now, notice um, in Spanish, you normally stress the next to last vowel. So we'd normally ex expect to stress the E and say Angela, but they don't like that. So there's an accent mark over the A that says, hey, don't stress the next to last vowel, stress me. Say Angela. Same thing um, with Jesus. We expect to say Jesus, but that accent says, hey, don't stress the next to last vowel, stress me. So an accent mark says break the rule. Don't stress the vowel you expect to stress, stress me instead. Now, since it's two people, Angela and Jesus, it's they ate, comieron mi burrito. And notice it's I-E-R-O-N. In Spanish, it's always I before E, except for 6, 20, 30 in baseball. Now, uh, Carlos and I, we ate the apples, okay? It's comimos, we ate. Now, how are we going to remember that manzana is apple? Well, if you're familiar with the story in Genesis of Adam and Eve, man, Adam, or man, got in trouble when he ate the apple. <laughs> see the word man and see the word z? Man got in trouble when he ate the apple, when he ate the manzana. So manzana's apple, apple's manzana. Now, uh, the tall girl ate the cheese. Notice in English we say tall girl, in Spanish we say girl tall. She ate the cheese. Now, Mr. Holt, I thought comio meant he ate. I-O at the end of a verb can mean five things. He ate, she ate, it ate, you sir ate, you ma'am ate. So you have to write la chica. If you just wrote comio el queso, we wouldn't know if it's he, she, it, you sir, or you ma'am. Now, queso's cheese. Everybody say quesadilla. Quesadilla. A quesadilla has a tortilla and cheese, so it's called a quesadilla. Or, I want to buy a case of cheese. Okay? Alright, this has been Comer to Eat Preterite Sentences.